And good morning, folks. I hope this is running. It didn't beep. Uh, let's see. All right. <sighs> it's one of those mornings. Okay, first off, the wildfire in Hawaii, around Maui, was not a directed energy weapon by foreign powers or our powers. A lot of people are bloody idiots. It's a rumor. Okay, it's a cover story made up of a bunch of morons at my old workplace. I won't tell which three-letter agency it was, but uh, it's a cover story. All right, what happened in Hawaii and who's covering it up? DOJ. I'm still researching on the FBI, but DOJ is covering up. It's that group, Antifa. Okay, if you look at the pattern of burn... Throughout that area, I think uh, Hawaii police is involved too. Okay, if not, they're going to be a big in investigation. But always Uncle Alan's going to be right. I'm going to be 63 to 0 in a couple weeks when they find out. And it goes all the way up to Brandon. Okay, those, I think, 100 people, they still haven't found the 20 people. It should be about 88 people dead dead so far all right so it's not an energy weapon it's not lightning it's not water vapor or co2 god i hate people all right it's antifa they took advantage of a heat wave a real serious one caused by planetary change okay it was a terrorist tap being covered up by the doj and brandon because it's one of their favorite groups, Antifa. Now, you look at that burn pattern, any fire investigator will tell you that was arson. But they don't want to lose their job, so they're going to keep quiet about it. It's, you know, government hush-up. So far, Uncom's going to be 63 to 0. You can lie all they want. Just say no to Captain Crazy and crew. Join up to Die Bullfrog 79. Hit the like button. Leave a nice comment. Send money $2.17. See PayPal below. Stop the madness. Keep calm. Don't panic. Carry on. Save America from 2040. The horrors. A lot of you won't. And Uncle Island has to put you down. It's going to be very ugly. How ugly is it? It's going to be evil ugly. By your answers and your comments, you have a smartphone addiction. You're in the 50-mile death trap. You're bugged in, retired or elderly. If you don't think so, then you're in that other group that I mentioned. You're on a fixed income, pension, SSI, savings, no water source, isolated. You have no idea what's going on in the real world. Isolated, no group, lots of YouTube family and friends. And if you look at your home page, it's a letter icon. There's nothing on the board. Okay. And you don't have anything on the about page. If I was an AI or algorithm, I would bring you off as a spam channel. So upgrade your channel, put in an icon. Fill out at least two paragraphs in your about page. It's like people like just drive me nuts. Okay, check out Danger Dale. Who's your prepping nurse? Prepping by faith. Thank God she's in South Dakota. Uh, prepping with Sarge. Um, like the mic. Did well. Hope you get something interesting before hurricane season is going to hit. It's going to be a late hurricane season because I'm figuring out what's going on in the ocean currents. And that's a lot of math. Okay, Sassy Gal Prepping, Alpine Preparedness, Nay Nay's Northern Prepper, Garden State Gardener, and uh, Lori's Drifty Kitchen. She got the bug that I had really bad. She's on antibiotics and she's doing dialysis. I came close to that but I'm fine I took moxicillin and two other antibiotics and I'm fine only thing I had was gum uh, what you might call it, infection they had to drain it 
Okay, and check your areas. I tell people when you get this, there's got to be a lab around there. Okay, we won't go to that. This is the other group I was telling you about. Millennials, Generation Z, college students, gamers, social media people. I swear to God, it's like, you didn't see the last video. I talked about the 20... What was it? $10 trillion debt from BlackRock. All right. That causes in nine months. All right. People don't understand. It causes a spiral deflation. Look at East Germany. When I was there, they were flushing marks down the toilet. The sewers are clogged up with their currency. All right. That is what is going to happen. Stop voting Democrats, drag them off out of office. Every progressive, every liberal, every Democrat, you beat them in the head. Okay, now the whole Hawaii disaster in Maui. Like I said, arson burn. A lot of people were fleeing with. Okay. We're screaming and running away with one of these. Same with the Ukraine, same with everything. Pretty soon, same with Taiwan. Everybody should have a 15 pound go bag. Okay, my weight's 15 pounds. I only carry the essential and I run with it. Okay, I do two and a half miles. I carry this every day. 15 pounds. Only the bare necessities. What I need to survive to get to my go bag. This is my get home or uh, uh, whatchamacallit, not go bag. To get to my bug out bag. This is my go bag. 15 pounds, less than 30 pounds. The 30 pounds is my go bag, is my bug out bag. This one is my go bag that I always carry with me. In the office, and the truck, it always on my person. It doesn't stay in the truck. It does not stay in the office. It's on me. Okay? 15 pounds. Do you walk 2.4 miles with 15 pounds on your back or in front of your chest? I have it rigged, so if you shoot me in the, this thing, you'll be surprised when I pull out my 44 Magnum and blow your head off. Or your nuts. Um, I'm calm's getting old. I can't see past 15 feet. Okay. The reason why I practice with that 15 pounds every day, two and a two point four miles. Okay. A lot of you don't have a go bag. A lot of you go on vacation. Do 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 do. RV has all our supplies. Well, if I throw in a half can of gasoline and a road flare. You don't have an RV. It's what's in your pockets and what you carry in that bag. Okay? And you have to go home. You're out in God knows where. Hawaii. Ah, uh, it'll never happen here. It's paradise. Okay? Or the Boy Scout camp. It won't happen here. Bear Grylls is going to watch over us. Okay? Boy Scout j Jamboree. You Boy Scouts and Girl Scouts, take care of yourselves. Bye. He went to a hotel. Bear Gribbs went to an air-conditioned hotel, left 5,000 international Boy Scouts out in the boonies, both in England and South Korea. Okay, this is why I don't like panels and I don't like so-called survival expert. Okay, don't trust nobody. Don't trust Uncle Al. You go out there and you say, yep, I have a book out bag. Where is it at? It's in my house. You're in Hawaii. But my house is in Cleveland, Ohio. Duh. All right. Also, this one's a, a uh, what's been called airline approved. And if you look at it, I do have side pockets to hold one liter bottle of water. I always have two liters on it. When I'm not in transit, no water. Okay, just basics. Fifteen pounds basics adapted to my needs. Urban, suburban, and wilderness, and cover all the five C's. 
So anyway, I'll catch you later. Be good out there. Share a meal. All this is illusion right here. If you have no people, no people in contact, I contact a lot of people and I talk to them. All right. But if you're only on this social media, YouTube, this is illusion. This is not reality. All right. Be a good person. Long live the Republic. Grow a garden. Share a meal with a neighbor and friends. Talk. Okay. More people you contact, the better you are. A lot of people don't do that. And I'll catch you later. God bless. Be a nice person. Bye now.